Hi guys, this is Sachi here. You're watching Marja. Today I have this amazing plant, commonly known as air plant, and uh, scientific name is Delancia ionantha. And uh, this is an amazing plant. This just hangs like this on my window, and uh, without any soil or any moss or anything, because it is an epiphyte. In its natural condition, they grow like uh, clinging on to some trees. and that's how they grow they get the moisture from the rain or the humidity around an any area so these plants are very easy to take care but there are certain needs you need to fulfill i have this plant for more than like one and half year about and this has been very healthy and in very good conditions with me i have already killed two of them but um, this one was really amazing the reason behind that i'll be telling you in this video so first of all the watering condition the watering condition there are two methods either you can have your uh, spray bottles or a mist uh, bottle and you can spray or mist them like once every day right on all the sides and then the second uh, method is the dipping in the water method that me method needs need not to be done every day you have to do that once a week for me i do it like every sunday just take a bowl full of water and dip this in and this should completely be inside the water for like 15 to 30 minutes i just leave it and do all my plant work and then just when you take it out just drip all the water from this make sure you keep it uh, all the conical section down and keep it down for some time under a fan or any airy situation you do not want to ha have water inside this conical uh, things so because if you leave water there they'll rot eventually so for me i just hang it in the window like this and there's a fan around it so i just hang it and it dries up so you need to dry it up and for the water you need to be very careful you cannot use a tap water for these because they will cause some salt build up and they'll make the plant eventually die slowly you have to use ro water any drinking water or mineral water for me i use ro water because that's easily available with me and uh, you have to use that water for e also for spraying and also for dipping that's the best water like uh, for air plant and if you can get some rain water you can collect them those are the best for air plant they love them because they have good quality of nitrogen and other minerals they need right so this is the water thing for them and about the fertilizer i don't add usually sometime i add some drops of seaweed solution into the water i dip it in and uh, that is the way but most of the time i haven't done any special fertilization for them because i don't think uh, they need much if you can get rain water this, this will be the best for it and um, how i keep them in good condition the secret to that is the light trust me i have kept some tilancia in medium light condition but they have just rotten and died for me but this one i have been just hanging on my south facing window which receives good amount of high bright and direct light and also some sun around the day and it is doing well and this has also given me two three blooms in the blooming season so this plant like they have different cones so basically if you separate them there will be different kind of tilancia so this is an entire bunch so each bunch here in the blooming season it the edges of the leaves turns like a uh, pinkish or pinkish purplish and then that part blooms with the with white flower for this so that has happened with me and this is very amazing to watch because the flower just survives for a day so these are very uh, very amazing plants if you are starting with this please take care of the water and light needs and you don't have to do much and even if you somebody who travel and just be around like once a week then also you just have to water this a week and uh, yeah that's it about this amazing plant uh, let me know in the comment section uh, how do you take care of your tilancias and uh, thank you for watching i'll see you in the next video bye